Hey guys, Matthew Buxton here, coming to y'all straight from quarantine. I guess you could call me Mask Few. Today we're going to be talking about Never Let Me Go by Kazuo Ishiguro, but more specifically, the symbol of the woods behind Hailsham. The woods behind Hailsham act as a watchful eye over the students, scaring them. One might say a sort of big brother. Mr. Buxton, Mr. Buxton, Mr. Buxton! Yes, child, who most definitely is not me. I have an older brother, but he doesn't watch or scare me. I'm not talking about your actual older brother, if you do have one. I'm talking about the character from George Orwell's 1984. You see, big, this big brother is less of a character and more of an entity or organization. He acts as the government's eye. He sees you when you're sleeping, he knows when you're awake, he knows if you've been bad or good. In a sense, he's just more of a brutalist Santa Claus. The big difference is that these students are very aware of the forest's existence, and they're in fact terrified of what it holds. Being scared to enter some random forest at night is one thing. Being scared just to look at it is a whole other topic. In one case, a student is forced to look at it for punishment and won't stop crying the entire night. There are all sorts of stories of what have happened there. There's the boy who got his foot chopped off there. There's the girl who gets trapped in the forest waiting to get back onto campus. And many more stories like those. The forest is a portrayal of the outside world to these students. A scary, harsh, sinister, unforgiving place that will leave you outside the gate banging to get back in. Mr. Buxton, Mr. Buxton, Mr. Buxton! Yes, child, who definitely isn't me, because now you're in a different spot. If the clones know they're going to be donated, what keeps them pushing on through all their troubles and times of distress? What keeps them going? Okay, that, that's a lot to unpack in that. Uh, and, oh, oh look, at the, well, look at the time. We're just running out of it. So maybe I'll answer that question later. But this is Maddie B, signing off. Adios, bro chaches.